Alrighty, so we have another construction update. It's a weekday. There's a construction update every weekday. I feel like I don't even need to say it's another construction update anymore. All right, let's get into it. No new track pieces arrived from what I can tell. If it's hard to tell now because literally there's so many track pieces in the storage area. I'm literally like, did another one arrive? I don't think another one arrived. So it looks like no track pieces arrived. Um, if they did, it's that one piece over there next to the, the pre-drop or the holding break. Um, that's the only piece that I, I think new has arrived. Other than that, I'm like looking very closely now to see if I missed anything. It looks like nothing arrived. So um, nothing new has arrived. Uh, I have a feeling that's because uh, they're waiting for some more pieces to be removed from that storage area. And when I left today, it looked like they were getting ready to remove a ton of pieces and put them in here. So they had three trucks, three flatbeds waiting to be loaded um, and they'll probably be loaded and then transported to here. So I'm assuming it's going to be able to support columns through the lift hill as there's literally only one more turn piece and then a, like um, a piece that leads to the pre lift and then the pre lift itself. So there's three more pieces, technically two. So two more pieces before the elevation starts and they install, as you can see here, two pieces a day as that seems to be the average for installation so far. So we're looking at two pieces a day. Thursday is the original estimated date. There's two more pieces before the pre-start of the lift, so that where it angles up. And then there's literally six pieces for the lift in total. We're still looking at Thursday, Friday, Monday as the completion of the, um, the lift hill. And that's insane. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday, you're definitely gonna see the lift hill mostly started half started or completed it depends what they do um i know that once they get supports installed it's very quick to installing the lift hill they move really quick the only thing that i'm concerned about is i do not see signs of a large crane yet there is no large crane in storage off to the side waiting but we do know that when track arrives uh a, a crane arrives no they don't use this crane to unload track when it arrives it's actually a third party company that comes in with another crane and unloads the track. So for all we know, the crane will just arrive when it's needed. Um, but those cranes typically need some installation time themselves. So that's what's interesting. We don't see any crane on site yet, but we have heard that the lift hill was supposed to be done before Labor Day, and it's looking like that. So the crane should be here any day. In fact, I'm hoping for tomorrow. Um, there is nowhere to store it while this crane is there. I mean, this is bare minimum movement, as you can see with this crane. So they are literally probably going to bring in this crane the day before installation of the lift hill. And I'm actually starting to predict that they'll start installing the drop and continue building this coaster um, through operation. So they do a lot of the work in the morning. So when I get to the park, a lot of this work's already done or track pieces are already in here waiting to be installed. So they're here around four or five in the morning starting their day. Um, so who knows what they'll be able to get done. Now, what's interesting is, um, as you can see here, this is a great angle. They are still working on the storage shed, and they are starting to install the, I don't know the proper name for it, but it's like a chain link fence that protects fallen items from guests below. So you can tell below the brake run here, as you see here, the queue line for the ride is going to uh, be housed, as you see in the POV and the animations. So you can definitely tell that the queue line is going to go under there. Um, and yeah, they're getting all that installed. They are off to a fantastic start. Um, and I have a feeling this is going to be one of the quickest projects we've seen on a coaster being built. Um, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and share this video for others. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.